Good morning, everyone. Welcome to another edition of Danny Dishes. Um, thank you to everyone that watched and commented and reached out last week. It was really appreciated, and um, I just thank everyone for giving me this space to kind of let those emotions flow, especially when you don't really expect it to happen. Um, so thank you for giving me this space, internet, for that to uh, be able to actually happen. So it really felt amazing to kind of like get that off of my chest or the weight off my shoulders, if you will. Um, and it didn't mean that everything magically gets better because you kind of all of a sudden own up to what is happening, but it allows me to make sure I continue to reach out when those thoughts or those tough times happen. Um, because I know what happened in the past was that I hid away and I even now that I've started this journey, I can actually recognize those kind of um, indicators that, you know, things aren't going right because I'm not posting so much or not sharing as much or thinking to myself, like, I don't want to bother putting this up there because no one's going to understand or relate and I'm just going to feel so alone, blah, 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 and that kind of over that. So now we are switching gears to a more positive side. So on Sunday, I posted a picture on the blog's Facebook page, Weight Off My Shoulders, and it was me in the, like, my tri-kit pull down and then uh, just the sports bra, which was, like, really scary to put that, that picture up there. And because I, I put it up there because as soon as I took the photo, it was, like, picking myself apart of like this and the extra skin there and blah, blah, blah. And, you know, some people don't see it, but of course we're our own worst critics. So I just like tore myself apart and was like, why am I doing this? There's no reason. Like if I can't love my own body, like no one else is, that sort of thing. So a reader actually commented on one of the posts and said that she has been working on being more positive. And what's helping is Every day, she stands in the mirror and says three positive things about herself. And she sort of challenged me to do that as well. So I thought to myself, I am going to challenge all of you to join me. So it's going to be a 30-day positivity challenge. So it's going to be at some point in your day, looking in the mirror and saying three positive uh, positives about yourself. Um, so I'm thinking that I'm probably going to try to share them on the blog's Facebook page, on the blog, and if not, at least say like, yes, I've done mine, and then reach out and see if anyone else wants to add theirs. So I'm going to start the challenge today. So once I stop filming, I'm actually going to get ready for work and do a whole bunch of other stuff and probably do it later, but I promise that it's going to be done at some point today. So who of you will join me? 30 day positivity challenge, three positives a day. Are you up for it? Let me know in the comment section below or tweet me, Irish Eyes 1982 Either way, let me know you're in and we are going to nix this negative together. Have a good day.